It has been six years since the baffling disappearance of 28-year-old Babita Sarju, who left her mother's Timiri home to go meet her estranged husband and four-year-old son at the Kitisi Wall on the night of the Diwali motorcade back in 2010. To the contentment of relatives, top police officials including Crime Chief Wendell Blanham and Commissioner of Police Silal Prasad have decided to reopen the case after obtaining credible statements from a number of persons. Champa Sunarain, Babita Sarju's mother, a woman who has been knocking on doors for many years to get answers, refuses to believe that her daughter is dead. To this day, I'm still saying that I still believe she's out there somewhere. She was held against her will. I call this as the premeditated act, plan organized crime by my son-in-law. Sunarain strongly suspects her son-in-law because not only was he the last of seen Babita, but the two shared a turbulent relationship, the effects of which were revealed during a court battle for their nine-year-old son. She was working at BK International and he took a new picture and exposed it to international to a place, stick it on the trucks, throw it on the ground, on the roadway. And when she got it that morning, the men then started picking up this picture and said, rush to Bobby, thank you for it. The mother believes that exposing Babita's nude photographs at her workplace was her son-in-law's way of preventing Babita from gaining custody of her son. That matter was in the human service before um, Priyamani Chan. Mm -hmm. And Priyamani Chan, who said from the nude picture, um, she said you must file custody for the child. But you know, you will have to have a job before having custody of the child. So it's like this. she got that job and she was working there. She was doing well. She was an account there. Police did find some evidence linking Babita's husband to the nude photo case. But the matter was thrown out following the woman's disappearance. The case got dismissed in 2011 On because the there is no Babita, there is no evidence. This newscast has made several attempts to speak with Babita Sarju's husband, who on multiple occasions has accused the media of being one-sided in the case. Yet, he refuses to tell his side of the story. George?